Hey there, Tesla enthusiasts. It's an electrifying day because we're back with some cutting edge tech. Get ready to be wowed by the 2021 Tesla Model Y dual motor and its mind blowing summon feature. But hey, before we embark on this adventure, let's kick things off with a bang. Hit that like button, smash the subscribe if you haven't already, and let's make this video go viral. We've got a revolution on our hands. Check this out, folks. Feast your eyes on this 2021 Tesla Model Y. It's not just a car, it's a spaceship on wheels. And the star of today's show, the summon feature. So let's define the summon feature. The summon feature in Tesla vehicles allows you to remotely control your car's movement using the Tesla app on your smartphone. By interacting with the app, you can instruct the car to move autonomously, whether it's to come to your location, park in a specific spot, or navigate to a certain path. But here's the kicker. You control it through the Tesla app on your smartphone. You'll see yourself as a blue dot, and your car has a red arrow on the app screen, and you move the white marker around to indicate where the car is gonna go when activated. It's like you're playing a high-tech game with a real car. Now, let's watch this sorcery unfold. This is my first time trying it, and trust me, it's nothing short of magic. Just wait until you see the Model Y spring into action. Mind-blowing, doesn't even cover it. So, where can you unleash the summon feature superpowers? Buckle up, because we're diving into the real world. Okay, so here's what I mean. Picture this, it's pouring rain, you're wrapping up work, or you're at the store, and your car gracefully finds its own parking spot. You activate it through the app, select your spot, and voila! All you have to do is just hold a go to target feature for the car to continue on that track. And if you needed to go straight forward or backward, just use the up and down arrows. But hold on, because I've got some thoughts to share, I'm about to give you the inside scoop. We'll talk about where it excels, get ready for some wow moments, and of course, where there's room for improvement. Let's get down to the brass tacks. So let's start with the pros. Convenience. The summon feature offers an incredible convenience, especially in situations like heavy rain where you can have your car come to you without getting wet. Parking assistance. It's like a fantastic tool for tight parking spots. The car can navigate spaces that might be challenging for a driver to fit into. Impressive technology. It's a prime example of Tesla's cutting edge technology and sets the brand apart in the EV market. How you can customize it. You have control over the car's path through the app, making it highly adaptable to various scenarios. And most importantly, safety. With careful use, summon can enhance safety, like getting the car to pick you up in a well-lit area at night. Now for the cons. Complexity. Some users might find the app interface and controls initially complex, requiring a learning curve. Technical limitations. The feature's performance can be affected by factors like GPS accuracy and the environment, which may not make it suitable for all situations. Need for close supervision. The requirement to hold down the go to target button can be seen as a limitation, as it demands constant supervision during the process. Cost. The advanced technology in Tesla vehicles, including Summon, contributes to the vehicle's price, making it a costly option. And lastly, limited use cases. The feature is most useful in specific scenarios like parking lots or private property, so it may not be as practical for everyday situations. I drew a path on the app for the car to follow, and well, it decided to do things in reverse. It's a quirky little twist that I didn't even see coming. And let me tell you, I was highly impressed with how it was able to maneuver the entire path in reverse. Now, before you dive into your own summon adventures, let me arm you with some valuable tips to ensure a seamless and enjoyable experience. Number one, clear path and safe environment. Always ensure there's a clear path for the car to follow and that the environment is safe. Remove any obstacles or hazards that could impede in its movement. Number two, close supervision. While summon is active, keep a close eye on your car. Sometimes it might encounter unexpected obstacles or challenges and your supervision ensures a smooth operation. Number three, use the app precisely. The Tesla app is your control center. Make sure to use it precisely when drawing the path or selecting a destination for your car. Accuracy is key. Number four, adjust the speed. You can adjust the speed of the car using the app. Consider the situation and the surroundings when setting the speed to ensure safety. Number five, be mindful of others. If you're in a public space, be considerate of pedestrians and other drivers. Stay updated. Keep your Tesla software and app updated. New updates often bring improvements and new features, enhancing your overall experience. And number seven, practice and patience. Like any skill, using Summon effectively might take some practice. Don't be discouraged if things don't go perfectly the first time. Remember that the Summon feature is designed to enhance your convenience and driving experience, but it's important to use it responsibly and safely. 
By the way, I've got a little bit of history with Tesla at this point. I first owned a Tesla Model 3 back in 2020 and recently have upgraded to a 2023 Tesla Model S. I feel incredibly fortunate to have had the chance to play around with this 2021 Tesla Model Y and use this summon feature. It's like I've seen the evolution of Tesla's tech firsthand and I can't wait to share my experiences with you. But here's a little twist. I've also been able to use the full self-driving beta on the Model S. It's an incredible leap in autonomous driving technology. However, due to my Model S having hardware 4, I've not been able to use the summon feature or the auto park on it. And that's the story I'll share in another video. It's a glimpse into the ongoing advancements and variations in Tesla's tech, and I'm here to keep you in the loop. So before we conclude, let me tease you with what's on the horizon in the world of Tesla and autonomous driving. Summon is just one piece of the puzzle. Tesla full self-driving technology is continually evolving and with each update, it's one step closer to a world where your car can truly become your personal driver. Enhanced Autopilot, Navigator and Autopilot and more exciting features are making their way out to your Tesla. Stay tuned for an in-depth exploration of these innovations in upcoming videos. Tesla is at the forefront of this revolution and owning one of their vehicles means that you're part of this incredible journey. You're not just driving a car, you're driving that future. And as we journey towards this future together, I'll be here to break down the tech, share my experiences, and learn from yours. What's your take on the Model Y and the Summon feature? Is it as mind-blowing to you as it is to me? And hey, don't forget to subscribe because we're about to dive deeper into the world of Tesla tech. Thank you so much for joining us today. If you had a blast with this video, how could you not? Make sure you share it with your friends because knowledge is power and we're electrifying brains here. Until next time, stay charged, drive electric, and I'll see you in the next one.